What's up my human straight up viper here today on the mic and through your speakers and today I'm here to bring you a video uh, explaining my recent uh, actions or decisions or whatever you want to call it. Um, let's just say some drama went down, some changes went down and I uh, just needed a change and it was a roster change obviously. And before I start, I just want to say I'm not trying to bash anyone, not trying to roast anyone, not trying to put anyone down. It's just what happened. It's just how everything kind of played out. And, I mean, stuff happens. So I'm just going to kind of give you a breakdown. I'll just say people got dropped, people got picked up. And I'm going to start with my team. Well, actually, I'm going to start about the other team. Um, Vintage, obviously, as you know, is an organization and we have multiple teams and we just picked up a second team uh the new captain uh, just came back his name is momo lu uh he's the captain and then the uh his teammate is the returning ghost uh i teamed with him for like six months uh i've been teaming with him been like great friends since like you know maybe oh nine um, he lives in my city, you know, we're great friends in real life, and, uh, he's on a team with him to help him out, uh, they both are on the same page, they know what they want to do, so yeah, and I think that they are looking for two currently, so, uh, oh my god, I need to change that ringtone, but I think they're looking for two currently, if you're interested, hit them up at John Momolu 2 or at the Vintage Ghost, so, uh, basically what we're trying to say here for my team is some stuff went down. So, I'm just going to kind of give you a breakdown of the story of everything. So, it all started Friday afternoon. I got a text from the editor of Vintage, great friend of uh, Conman's. Uh, he texted me saying, hey, Trent's thinking about leaving. And I knew his loyalty has been getting really bad. And I texted him, I confronted him about it. He didn't answer me. Uh, two days passed, and he finally texted me back saying, I'm, I don't have to answer to you, or some crap like that. And his still name was Vintage, all that crap on Twitter, and I was like, okay, then what are you doing? He was like, I'm still on your team, but I'm just not talking to you, man. So, I don't know what happened. Today, he like changed his name on Twitter, Scumbag Truancy or something, that's what he wanted on the team. Uh, and I just had enough, the loyalty, the stress, um, some of his gameplay is just unbearable. And I just, uh, I cut loose, dropped him. And sure, we were great friends. We've been teaming for four years. And he was a great friend of mine. He was just like a brother. But um, obviously me and him wouldn't get along. And he won't talk to me. I'm not going to talk to him. I think it's best if we just, you know, kind of go our separate ways and that's how that worked out. Gamble, kind of a shorter story. Um, I texted him the other night about Trent. He really agreed with me, and then out of the blue, I went out after I texted him, like all the possibilities I might do after Trent le uh, might leave or get dropped. Um, I just kind of said, you know, I might be a free agent. I might be a YouTuber and retire. I might go to coaching. I don't know. He took that personally and was like, yo, dude, I, I don't know if I want to be on this team anymore. He wouldn't text me after that, and he just kind of removed me. So I guess you could say he left, or I don't, I, we might have parted ways. I, I don't know. I honestly have no idea. So that's what happened there. So that left me with no people on my team. And after that... Um, I went to some friends of mine, some friends of mine that, uh, are great players. And the first one, obviously a great friend of mine, great player, great AR, really aggressive, um, and really vocal, knows what to do, knows, you know, what the game is. Uh, his warrior, his name's warrior. Um, if you watch my streams, you watch my videos, you might know him. His name was Walk Off Warrior, now see Matic Warrior. No, his name's Warrior97, something like that. His real, name, his real name's Evan. Uh, that's another way you probably know about him. And me and him, uh, we're on the same page now, knowing what we want to do, what we want to make a team out of, and I think we're going to work out well. So we went on a teammate search. Everything burst in the flames. Couldn't find the right one, and then a old friend contacted me, uh, and his old name was Nex. You might know him as Josh. Uh, his new name is Yetables, Yeti. I, I'm not sure what he's going to change it to. Uh, he's a new competitive player now. He well, he was an old one. I guess he can 
he returned like Nex, the other Nex <laughs> from uh, he used to be on EGS. I have no idea what he's on now, but um, he was like a PC gamer or a PS4 or Xbox One or something. And came back and wants to do some competitive. Uh, he's like vintage where I belong. Just let me back on, and I'll show you why stuff like that. And uh, you know it it worked out well. And uh, we have a really, really solid team of three right now, and I really couldn't ask for anything better uh, out of a team. And with a fourth, I think we can strive and become a great team, maybe even go to events. I don't know. But uh, that's just my personal opinion. I think we're going to do greater than my per previous team. Not trying to bash anyone once again. I just That's my personal opinion. And before all of you people that are Trent's friends, uh, I'll just kind of name names. Big Oscar, Jason VP, Hollow Skulls, all those people. If you're going to sit here and comment on my video, he's in a better place now. You're so stupid for dropping him or some crap like that. No. If you are going to talk crap, please scrum us. Uh, and that's all. That's the only way you can talk in Call of Duty. That's the only way you can. So um, that's just straight and simple right there. And um, I think that we're going to be solid. And if you are f a competitive player looking for a team, we are looking for a fourth. A we need an SMG. Uh, me and Josh run the OBJ. Uh, Evan runs the AR. And uh, we're just looking for an SMG AR Slayer that can just do some work. Uh, preferably in between ages of like 13 to 17 maybe uh, and dedication is key too and uh, that's about it so if you're interested please uh, at me on twitter at vintage viper I is a one in vintage and that is about it so I hope you guys understand more I released a twit longer earlier um, but that didn't really didn't really explain much but Dude, my phone is so annoying. But uh, I hope that explained any questions. You can comment. I don't care. But uh, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed my explanation because it's so enjoyable. And uh, I hope to make some videos this week about some random stuff. I uh, want a Viper story time, a topic video, all that stuff. But you get to see my beautiful face because my Roxio still doesn't work. So I hope you guys enjoy. And I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, remember to stay awesome. See ya.